I graduated from Georgetown Dental School, then taught there as a clinical instructor for about five years. Meanwhile, went into private practice as an associate dentist. So I was working for a, an owner dentist. I did that for about 10 years, actually, and that gave me the time freedom to learn a lot of things. I spent three days a week usually practicing and probably three days a week taking courses all over the country and learning about some of the different things that we now incorporate into our, uh, into our practice. I've been in practice in Annandale for 40 years now. And during that educational opportunities, I've gotten fellowship degrees from the Academy of General Dentistry, the Academy of Stress and Chronic Disease, the International Academy of Oral Medicine and Toxicology, and the American Academy of Ozonotherapy. And I've also served as president of the International Academy of Oral Medicine and Toxicology, or the IAOMT, from 1994 to 96. Because of my work in the area of mercury fillings and the concerns that mercury poses to the environment as well as to the physiology and health of patients, I was the first dentist ever to be invited to be expert witness before Congress, first in 2002 and then two more times after that. Besides Congress, I've also testified on the subject before the National Institute of Health, the Food and Drug Administration, the Environmental Protection Agency, the National Academies of Science, and the United States uh, State Department. Thereafter, I became board certified by the American Naturopathic Medical Board, the National Board of Homeopathy and Dentistry, and uh, the American Board of Dental Sleep Medicine, and uh, co-authored a chapter in a British textbook on complementary therapies in dental practice. I'm a minimalist in my clinical treatment I like to do the least amount of dentistry necessary to keep a patient functional, cosmetically acceptable, and to keep their health supported by the dentistry that we do.